fans, fold your hearts. Urgent news has just arrived and will shake the team's structures. Get ready for the arrival of a possible new player. But before sharing this news with you, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the development of this contract, because we'll update you on everything firsthand. Former Pittsburgh Steelers wide receiver Antonio Brown is ready to make his return to the football field, but this time wearing the colors of the Albany Empire in the Arena Football League, AFL. According to exclusive statements obtained by WNYT, Brown has confirmed that he plans to don an Empire uniform for this season, and his debut could be in the next home game scheduled for May 27. This news has caused quite a stir in the world of football as we will see one of the NFL's most iconic stars compete on a different stage and challenge the talented receiver's skills and adaptability. The support of the fans is vital to the success of the team. Are you ready to give yours? Like the Steelers. Brown, who had a remarkable NFL career, played in seven games his final season, catching 42 passes for 545 yards and four touchdowns. With seven 1,000-yard seasons to his name, Brown's return to the football field has generated anticipation and excitement among AFL fans and the receiver supporters alike. But that is not all. Additional reports indicate that Brown has been in contact with free agent quarterback Cam Newton, exploring the possibility of joining the Empire team. The addition of Newton, who has three Pro Bowl selections, would add even more stars and talent to Albany's roster, creating a fascinating offensive dynamic to take on AFL opponents. News of Antonio Brown's arrival in the AFL and the prospect of Cam Newton joining the team have generated a great deal of excitement and attention in the league. What do you think, Pittsburgh Steelers fan? Is this news positive for our team or not? Be sure to share your opinion in the comments, as it is crucial for us. And stay tuned as I'll be bringing you the latest Steelers news at all times.